They got what was coming. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So I'm gonna hit this gym really quick, but I'm gonna do the intro to this video first. So today we are going to be comparing the Black Ops 4 Spitfire with the Black Ops 3 Spitfire or the Vesper. So we're gonna compare damage output, the range, the recoil stability, uh, the aesthetics, everything about the guns. We're gonna try to have a good free for all match in Black Ops 3, and then we're gonna obviously drop some deatomizers in Black Ops 4. Or, or uh, nuclears. Why did I say the atomizers? But yeah, we're gonna be playing some BO3 today, some BO4. It's gonna be an interesting video, and I'm just gonna talk to you guys uh, during the gameplay. Also, big shout out to my boys over at Tay Rock for sending me this watch, man. You guys know me, I like some free shit. Uh, I like it a lot. So, this watch right here, I'm gonna leave their stuff in the description box. They have some nice, affordable watches. I mean, I'm not really too much of a watch person, to be honest with you guys. I have a Citizen watch right here, and then I had my G-Shock for about, I've had this for about maybe, I'd say, I've been years now. So I've had these two watches. It's actually pretty cool to have something like this, you know? I'll put it on really quick to show you guys. But also, really quick, hey, it don't look too bad, dog. It don't look too bad. I'm gonna leave all their stuff in the description box. And if you guys actually end up just peeping the website, uh, just let me know through like an email or a Twitter message or whatever. Stick to the very end of the video. I don't know if I'm allowed to do this. I, I think I might get flamed for this bullshit because you guys know uh, as far as giveaways go. I okay, so what I'm doing right now, I dude, I I I'm probably gonna get flamed for this bullshit, but I have so much shit to give out. It's beyond ridiculous. Like the stuff that I have, I don't need. Like I have uh, I have like three Black Ops 4 copies that I've yet to give out, but I've announced the winners. So you guys know Nirvana, Trap God, Trap Gamer maybe, I think. Uh, and then Shauna. You guys know that you guys won those things and I've yet to give it out yet. My, my cousin, he's going to be giving that pretty soon, so stay put. So I don't know if I'm allowed to do another giveaway without having the other things given out yet. <laughs> like shipped out. So I don't know. I'm going to test the waters. I'm very like bad with managing shit like this. So I'm going to have my cousin do the behind the scenes, behind the scenes very soon and ship them all out. But stick to the very end for some important announcements. Enjoy the gameplay, enjoy the commentary. I'll see you guys later. Back on the Nuketown grind on Black Ops 3. Look at this shit, look at this lobby, holy cow. Using the Vesper with grip and I believe quick draw. Nothing too special, because I don't have anything really ranked up on this account. I don't have the Vesper ranked up. But I did know that when this game first launched, the Vesper was probably one of the best weapons in the game. I don't know if you guys remember, but the Vesper before the patch was literally overpowered. It was like the Spitfire of Black Ops 4. So, I don't know. I mean, you guys can let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Obviously, the Vesper right now is a little bit more weaker or just it has more recoil than the Spitfire. But then again, not, I don't I don't know. Maybe it's just because I haven't used the Vesper. A lot of people that watch my videos nowadays, they just say, yo, how do you have no recoil on the, the Spitfire? I'm just like, dude, in my opinion, I don't feel like there is recoil on the Spitfire. I just control it really well. So maybe this whole little thing about the Vesper of how I'm currently playing right now, I feel a lot of recoil right now. I feel like I have to control it heavily, you know what I mean? But for me, maybe if I just use the Vesper maybe for like another two or three hours straight and maybe use it for a week straight, maybe I just, I'll just feel like there's no recoil, you know? Because in my opinion, if, if we're saying that Black Ops 4 Spitfire has a lot of recoil, and I personally feel like it doesn't, it definitely has to do a lot with just having experience on the weapon. We are currently 11 and 0. We already have the hater. Freaking C4 method and free for us. So overpowered. I don't know if you guys watched me since Black Ops 3. Make sure, hey, if you guys have been watching me since BO3, let me know in the comment section. And also, drop a like on the video, man. We are kind of close to getting this nuke. I, I don't know if we can. I, I mean, I'm. you know what? Fuck it. We're going to get this nuke. I, I, wasn't, I wasn't planning on doing it. I was just kind of just... I kind of just wanted to talk to you guys about the Spitfire and the recoil and, and the Vesper. But if we could get this nuke, hey, that would be great, dog. I'm not even trying. <laughs> I'm not even trying right now, bro. I'm, I'm literally just talking to you guys, but it's okay. Whatever. I'll. Hey, listen. If we get the nuke, we get the nuke, bro. 16 and 0. Oh, my God. If we get it, like... <laughs> If we actually get it like this, I'm going to freak out. This is actually insane right now. I can't believe it. But if you guys did play Black Ops 3, please let me know what your favorite weapon is. Was it the uh, the VMP? That was so good in Black Ops 3. I, I just feel like now in Infinite War... I, why do I... Infinite Warfare? I'm pretty sure in the intro of my video today, I said the, the Atomizer Strike. I don't know what's on my mind about Infinite Warfare. Maybe I just want to play it again. I don't know. 
kind of trying to lay down for it. Get out of here, buddy. Maybe I should go back to Infinite Warfare. I do have to complete the series that I'm doing on my channel where we throw it back to older Call of Duties. I got to finish playing MW3, Call of Duty 4, MWR. I actually don't know. I think that will complete the series. Oh, and Black Ops 1. 20 and 0 right now. I just really want to lock in this nuked out. If you guys don't know what a nuked out... Whoa! My voice almost just fucked up right there. If you guys don't know what a nuked out is, basically you just drop free for all. Oh! This is basically where you... Oh my... Oh! Oh! Oh my god, you know what? We're gonna limit just to one death then. We're gonna go 30 and 1 here. Holy cow, there, there's just no way that happened. Ah, the lobby, bro. Like, this lobby is good. And now this guy wants to anti? Get the guy wants to anti and put on a melee weapon. Come on, bro. I think this guy is trying to gun me down, bro. He's just trying to go for me. Look at this. Oh, maybe that's not him. Okay. Wow. Okay. But anyways, yeah. Black Ops 1, we gotta finish that series. And, and, uh, and yeah. Dude, the Vesper is really good. Now that I'm I'm using it only for maybe about three or four minutes into this game, and I just feel like there's no recoil anymore. I don't know. Like, I feel like there's no recoil right now. I feel like I can control it really well. That just shows you guys. It's all about experience, all about time played on the weapon. The more you use a Spitfire, I'm not trying to... I, honestly, guys... Wow. Black Ops 4, if you guys didn't know, they're having a weapon balancing thing next Tuesday. I think they're going to be nerfing this Spitfire. I'm hoping not, but we'll just have to see. I, I don't know. Let's go to Black Ops 4 and drop a uh, and drop a nuclear because Black Ops 4 just feels more easier for me. I don't know, but let's just go to Black Ops 4. I'm literally torn between having lightweight or dexterity. I don't know because if you have dexterity on the on this class setup, you know, any class setup, it pulls up your weapon faster after you slide. The little slide combination, like, I don't know. I don't know why. I, I, I don't know why, but... Whatever. Oh, I mean, I do know why. Obviously, because I have dexterity. Holy cow, what the hell? But, um, this guy won't die. Where's this guy at? Hello, hello, hello. Where are you at? Where are you at, buddy? Oh, this guy doesn't even know I'm back here. Hello? He's one shot. I'm going to push this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Which was grass. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Dexterity or lightweight. Because when I use lightweight, I do feel the difference. Almost died right there. Hello? I do feel the difference in speed. You might not notice the speed difference, but because I've been using lightweight for like the longest since like the beginning of the game, I, the, the only perks I used were scavenger and lightweight and maybe gung ho. No, it was gung ho. No, no, no. It, it wasn't even gung ho. I only added in gung ho about maybe a month ago, a month and a half ago. So yeah, I mean, gung ho has been something that I've been trying to use or I've been using for a long time now. Or no, wait, 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 what? Hello? I, I can't talk, bro. Whoa, my voice just cracked, bro. All I know is I was using Lightweight for the longest, and I don't even know if I had Gung Ho on. I don't think so. So, no, 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 no. It was just Lightweight and Scavenger, and I think I had four attachments. And recently, I just added Gung Ho about a month ago, and then maybe about a week and a half ago, I added Dexterity. We're just popping off right now. We're just literally toying with everybody right now. Look at this shit. Look at this, bro. Oh, my God. Can I, can I actually scoot in here? Okay, there we go. Whatever. But, yeah, um... Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, what did I want to talk about today? I wanted to talk about... Actually, I don't know. I actually don't know what I wanted to talk about. What the fuck? I, I swear I wanted to talk about something, but I guess not. But, uh, oh, yeah, the f Oh, my God, the giveaways and stuff. Okay, so what I'm going to do is now that I'm on a good sleeping schedule, as these guys are getting sauced up, dude, I think I'm just trying to get in this nuclear. I can't really focus. I always do this when I, when I play... What the f Fuck, the thing almost killed me. Uh, whenever I have a good sleepy schedule, like I wake up at 5 o'clock in the morning, and to me, that's a good sleepy schedule. When I wake up at 5 in the morning, and I sleep around maybe, I don't know, 9 p.m., which is a good day. That's 14 hours of the day, or was that more? I can't do math. That's 12 plus 3. That's 15. That's 15! No, that's more than that. That's 4 plus 12. No, that's 4 plus 12. equals 16. Oh, my God. I need to go back to school. That's 16 hours of the day where I'm awake, and I feel really productive. Today, I had to take my car in for maintenance, and, um... And, and when I took it to maintenance, I stopped by the UPS store. I was like, oh, my God. If I had the copies, I could have shipped this out. And the um, and the scuff controller uh, giveaway winner, I could have shipped these out. So, with that being said, I don't know if this is scummy or not. But I do want to give away these uh, these signed shaker cups that my, my sponsor sent me. I'm going to try to sign them with something that's permanent, mar like a permanent marker. And then I'm going to have my cousin ship them out. What the fuck? Wait. How did I get that guy? Oh, well, there's our nuclear. What the? How did I get that guy? I didn't even see that original first dude, but I'm assigned these three shaker cups and I'm going to send them out. Like I said, the way to enter these little giveaways that I haven't even gave out yet, which is my fault. I will be giving them out very soon. I'm just giving away. I'm just announcing winners at the moment. That's what I'm doing. Uh, sending them out is a different story. I'm kind of fucking up on that. So we'll be giving them out shortly, guys. The way to enter these giveaways, all you got to do is follow my Instagram and send me a DM that you have notifications on. 
that is the only way to enter these giveaways you only have to do that one time you can bump up your dm thing by just sending me another screenshot if you want and that guy really just beat me okay so i won 39 and 3 hopefully you guys did enjoy the video make sure you guys subscribe and i'll catch you guys later make sure you guys check out some advanced gg focus supplements down in the description box use code k3 for 10 percent off and and just get cracked the hell out also make sure you guys go check out the watches down below and let me know if you guys end up i don't know just checking them out i don't know Go check them out, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.